All right, guys, so today on Man Cave for Tools, we are going to go over the Milwaukee M12 heated gear. Now, I, I am going to say this, I've been using the M12 heated gear for a long time, and I am a huge fan of these products. Now, when it comes to keeping warm during the winter, it is essential to keep your core warm. And so that's what these actually do. I recently got the Milwaukee M12 Axis. Uh, this is pretty much the vest with the sleeves. The Milwaukee vest is my favorite when it comes to Milwaukee M12 heated gear because you can wear this over a hoodie or under a jacket. And you can wear uh, a jacket over this, but because of the sleeves, you'll feel restricted with the extra material just uh, building up around the around the joints. So the vest would majorly help you out with that. So you, you'll have more movement with your arms. But right here I have the M12 heated vest, which this is model, does it say the model number on here? It does not say the model number on this, but I will put that in right now. And when it comes to the vest, you have one button, which it does the back and the chest. I'll put the runtime in right now when it comes to the each of the modes, because as you can see, it has white, blue, and red. And so this is the M12 axis. This has uh, back, shoulders, and chest and I'm absolutely loving it. I gave the M12 heated hoodie to my friend because he works in his garage and he just needed a, a hoodie just to warm up once in a while. I really don't wear the hoodie that much because when I'm outside, I wear the vest and I wear a hoodie under the vest. And so I just wear a, a different hoodie that isn't a part of the M12 line and then I have this on top of that. And also I have the M12 heated uh, tough shell. All right, so this is, this is not like the Axis. And this is, I'm not sure what uh, this is lined with, but you do have Velcro at the wrists. And as you get here, it actually is sort of like, a, it's a much tougher shell, much thicker jacket altogether. And this one does have a pocket warmers. It does have the button for the chest and, uh, and back, and then it does have a pocket warmer, so you can warm up your pockets. Put your hand in your pockets and you'll feel warmth, which is actually a fantastic idea if you don't want to wear gloves all the time. When it comes to Milwaukee's heated gear, once it starts to get cold outside, they sell. So buying these, I seriously suggest you buy these all year round and prepare for the next uh, winter that's coming up because these sell out quick. And and as you guys are probably looking at it right now, you'll find out that a lot of this, most of this stuff is out of stock, especially in your size. So I was lucky with the with this access because I ordered this about two weeks ago and I got it the next day. And two days later, they were completely out of stock everywhere. So uh, I suggest you snag these up while you can throughout the entire year because once winter comes, these are gone, like everyone buys them because these are actually fantastic uh, heated gear to have. And when it comes to the M12 stuff, all you need is a couple of batteries and you can run this all day. You know, like uh, uh, by the time this is depleted, you have another one charged up and vice versa because this only takes like 40 minutes to charge. And this, uh, even with this, uh, with these on high heat, it'll last you two hours. So you could all, all you need is two batteries. And as long as you constantly change the battery out on the charger, you'll always have a heated, uh, you always have the heating elements active, you know, which, which is awesome. So I highly recommend you guys get uh, the M12 heated gear whenever you can. One thing that I, that I am bothered by, but you have to tolerate is the position of the battery because sometimes because sometimes this will be comfortable when I'm sitting in a seat. Sometimes it won't be. Sometimes it'll be just a bit too tight. And then I feel like I'm stretching the material as I'm sitting down. But sometimes uh, if you just <coughs> twist it like that, you know, so this just isn't pressing against the back of the seat, pressing forward while you're going backward. And so, yeah, but it's, it's, it's something they have to tolerate for something as comfortable as this. And yes, other companies do make heated uh, gear, like DeWalt makes heated gear, Makita makes heated gear, and a lot of other brands do make heated gear. But I highly recommend the Milwaukee M12 stuff just because they have a good assortment of heated stuff. They have a good assortment of gloves, hats, 
They have actual heated gloves. They have heated shirts uh, and long sleeve shirts. And they also make pants. I do not know if they make M12 heated pants yet. I did not look, but I'll, I'll tell you what the answer is right now if I find one. But yeah, but uh, let's get back. I'll show you guys what temperature this actually uh, gets up to while it's on my body. All right, so as you see, it is red, both of them. The chest area, 74, 75, 75 degrees. 75 degrees, and let's do the back, 72 degrees. 72 degrees for the back. Let's do the shoulder. And also remember, this has been open. This has not been on my body. 69 degrees on the other, uh, 68 degrees on the other side of the chest. And so, yeah, so this does really help you out to keep warm. And really quickly, an unboxing of the, uh, of the unit and the battery. Comes with, it, uh, comes with a wall mount, a wall outlet mount, does come with a Milwaukee uh, branded USB cable. Of course, instructions and warranty. Comes with the adapter, which this, if you guys get this a specific adapter, you could also charge your uh, portable devices with it, like your phone or your tablet. That's where the USB, uh, the, that's where the USB output is. And of course it comes with and it comes out with a two amp hour battery. All right, and also with this, with this uh, adapt, with this adapter, you could also test out the battery in uh, the battery level. Let's see what the battery of this is at. Just push the the battery level. It has two bars out of four. And you could also charge your battery through this. And this gets plugged into the wall, so you do not need the big M12 charger or the M18 and M12 charger. So yeah, so that's pretty much it, you guys. When it comes to this stuff, the, like I said, the M12 hoodie, the M12 jackets, they are totally worth getting because they really do help you keep warm. And so yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. I just wanted to do this video for you just in case if you need a little extra convincing that this is worth it, it is 100% worth it. I am asked at Home Depot while I'm wearing this because people see the lights on me and they want to know if buying these is totally worth it and I'm just letting you guys know I 100% back up the M12 heated gear. So that's pretty much it you guys. I hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos and please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave and Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.